conventional lithium-ion batteries could soon go the way of the dodo in the A-world. Toyota's CEO has shaken things up with a groundbreaking announcement of an all-new solid-state battery capable of delivering an incredible 1,000 kilometers of range and recharging in just 10 minutes, while traditional lithium-ion packs often falter in. Hayeth? Extreme weather or under harsh driving conditions, Toyota's cutting-edge design promises consistent performance across climates and terrains, unlocking a level of durability and efficiency the market has yet to see. Though can Tesla and its much-talked, about 4,680 cells keep their spot at the top? Or is Toyota about to change the game entirely? Let's dive in. Long admired for its leadership in hybrid tech with the iconic Prius, Toyota is now transforming itself into a major player in the fully electric vehicle market. In 2023, the automaker hit a big milestone selling around 150,000 fully electric cars worldwide, a 4-fold jump from its 2022 sales. While these numbers might look modest next to Tesla's impressive 1.88 million or Bide's 1.57 million deliveries that same year, for a brand once criticized for being slow to fully embrace of ease, this growth is both significant and carefully planned. For years, Toyota's strategy revolved around hybrids, with the Prius standing as a pioneer of low-emission driving since its debut in 1997. Even as rivals poured resources into all electric platforms, Toyota stuck to refining its hybrid and plug-in hybrid offerings. But change has been underway under the leadership of Koji Sato, who took over from Akio. Toyota in April 2023, Toyota-kun, has been ramping up its ambitions. A big part of this push is giving the Lexus brand a fresh electric identity. The Lexus RZ450e revealed in 2022 and the earlier UX300e launched and Europe, mark Lexus's first big steps into the electric luxury segment, setting the stage for Toyota's bold new electric chapter. Lexus aims to go fully electric by 2035, aligning with Toyota's broader goal of selling over 1.5 million electric vehicles annually by 2026. Toyota's plan for EV dominance is centered not only on scaling production but also on mastering the next generation of battery technology. Unlike Tesla and Bide, which continue to refine lithium-ion and lithium, iron phosphate or LFP chemistries, Toyota is investing heavily in solid-state batteries. Widely regarded as the holy grail of energy storage, these batteries promise dramatic improvements in energy density, charging speed, and safety. According to a company press release in June 2023, Toyota aims to begin mass production of solid-state batteries by 2027 or 2028. The company claims its prototypes have already achieved a range of up to 1,000 km per charge and can be recharged in just 10 minutes. Toyota is also rolling out a new EV platform known as the Beyond Zero or BZ architecture. This flexible modular design underpins vehicles in the BZ lineup, including the BZ4X, a mid-size electric SUV Co. developed with Subaru and launched in markets like the US, Japan, and Europe beginning in late 2022. The BZ platform is expected to support at least 10 new EV models by the end of the decade, tailored for different regional needs and body types, from compact cars for urban commuters to large subs and trucks for North America. Toyota is also exploring hydrogen fuel cell technology. In parallel, though battery electric vehicles remain the central focus of its mass market electrification roadmap, manufacturing capacity is also being scaled up to meet these ambitions. In 2023, Toyota announced a multi-billion dollar investment to build dedicated EVAN battery plants across key markets. In Japan, its plant in Toyota City is being upgraded to accommodate solid state battery production. In the U.S., Toyota is investing $13.9 billion through 2030 in battery manufacturing with a major facility under development in Liberty, North Carolina. This site will serve as a key hub for even hybrid battery production in North America. In Europe, Toyota is expanding its footprint in Poland and the U.K., converting existing plants to support electric drivetrain assembly and battery integration. Toyota's rising momentum comes at a time when the global EV market is undergoing rapid transformation. Over 14 million EVs were sold worldwide in 2023, accounting for 18% of total car sales, up from just 4% in 2020. At the heart of it all is Toyota's new solid-state battery. Solid-state batteries represent a major technological leap in energy storage, offering a fundamentally different architecture from the widely used lithium-ion batteries that dominate today's EVs. 
The primary distinction lies in the electrolyte, the medium that allows the flow of ions between a battery's anode and cathode. In this rapidly shifting landscape, Toyota stands uniquely poised to exploit a vulnerability through its game-changing solid-state battery initiative. Toyota's global battery, R&D operations in Japan, Germany, and the United States, combined with its emerging Gigafactory network, are geared toward achieving cost parity with lithium-ion cells by 2028. This milestone would enable Toyota to produce EVs that not only outperform existing models on the road, but also remain financially accessible to mainstream buyers. While Tesla remains committed to its 4,680 battery technology, which offers solid range and performance but still relies on liquid electrolytes, Toyota is preparing to leapfrog that standard entirely. If successful, Toyota will not merely catch up with Tesla, it will redefine the next generation of electric mobility. More importantly, Toyota is not burdened by the political baggage that now affects another company. The Japanese automaker maintains a reputation for corporate neutrality, safety, and reliability. Safety as another brand loses traction in key Western markets due to political polarization. Toyota can position its vehicles as the apolitical, technologically superior alternative. In markets like Germany, where one brand's registrations have plummeted, and in regions like rural America or Southeast Asia, where charging infrastructure remains limited, Toyota's solid state of is with their long range and fast recharge capabilities could gain massive traction. This is a rare convergence of technological innovation and brand opportunity. Another brand's branding missteps and changes in its customer base have created a vacuum in the premium Evis space. If Toyota can execute its rollout efficiently and stay on schedule, it may emerge not only as a fierce competitor, but as the undisputed leader of the EV industry's next era. This technological pivot is backed by Toyota's immense manufacturing scale and its deeply entrenched global supply chain, advantages that newer of startups have struggled to build from the ground up. The company's reputation for unparalleled quality control and vehicle longevity provides a level of consumer trust that is invaluable in a market where concerns over battery degradation and long-term reliability persist. This trust, coupled with a global dealership and service network that is virtually unmatched, positions Toyota to seamlessly introduce this advanced technology to a mass audience, easing the transition for consumers who may still be hesitant about electric vehicle ownership. The potential impact of a commercially viable solid-state battery extends far beyond just longer range and faster charging. The enhanced safety profile due to the non-flammable solid electrolyte could fundamentally alter vehicle design and insurance costs. Furthermore, the increased energy density means automakers can either use a smaller, lighter battery to achieve current range benchmarks, freeing up space and weight for other features, or they can push the boundaries of performance and capability even further. This opens up new possibilities for electric sports cars, heavy-duty trucks, and other vehicle segments that have been difficult to electrify effectively with current lithium-ion technology. The race is undoubtedly on, and Toyota's announcement has sent a clear signal to the entire automotive industry. While other companies are also researching solid-state technology, Toyota's concrete timeline for mass production and its proven ability to industrialize complex technologies give it a significant edge. The coming years will be a critical test of its ability to translate this promising laboratory breakthrough into a reliable, affordable, and high-volume product. If successful, the landscape of personal transportation could be reshaped for decades to come, solidifying Toyota's place not just as an at automotive giant of the past, but as a dominant force in the electric future. This rapid shift in the market presents a unique opportunity for Toyota, the Japanese automaker's global battery R&D operations in Japan, Germany, and the United States, combined with its emerging Gigafactory network, are geared toward achieving cost parity with lithium-ion cells by 2028. This milestone would enable Toyota to produce EVs that not only outperform existing models on the road, but also remain financially accessible to mainstream buyers. While another company remains committed to its 4,680 battery technology, which offers solid range and performance but still relies on liquid electrolytes, Toyota is preparing to leapfrog that standard entirely. More importantly, Toyota is not burdened by political challenges. The Japanese automaker maintains a reputation for corporate neutrality, safety, and reliability. As another brand loses traction in key Western markets, Toyota can position its vehicles as the apolitical, technologically superior alternative. 
In markets like Germany and in regions like rural America or Southeast Asia, where charging infrastructure remains limited, Toyota's solid state of ease with their long range and fast recharge capabilities could gain massive traction. This is a rare convergence of technological innovation and brand opportunity. If Toyota can execute its rollout efficiently and stay on schedule, it may emerge not only as a fiercest competitor, but as the undisputed leader of the EV industry's next era. Well, that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Did you like this video? Did you like this video? If you did, please consider liking, dropping a comment, and hitting the subscribe button so that you don't miss out on our new uploads. Also, don't miss this video you see on your screen right now. It's truly unbelievable.